Hello and welcome, Janet Beckers here from Romance Your Tribe and today let me take you behind the scenes of what it looks like to have a setup that allows you to completely run a remote business, to create podcasts, to do virtual coaching, to be able to run a virtual team, to do all of that from a tiny little bedroom in your house and that you can also take remotely if you need to. Let me show you what does that look like um, and I'll take you behind the scenes right now. You see, I've been running a remote business now for, well, this particular business I've been running for about 15 years and it's always been run remotely. And I've always done it in a way that's using the simplest strategies without me having to spend an absolute fortune and in a way that is designed for peak productivity. So I'm gonna show you how I have set up this room that I have been working in this way for a few years from this room. I'm gonna show you how I've set it up, how I've maximized the space to do that. And then I'm gonna show you the exact setup that I use to create high quality podcast videos, high quality training materials, live Facebook Lives, and for me to be running constant coaching virtually. I'll show you the whole setup I've got. And this is to do coaching where I can be doing whiteboarding, brainstorming with my clients, or where I can be looking them closely in the eye. The format is all there and it's all been set up for just a few hundred bucks. Now this might be something that you're going to need right now if you're finding yourself in the situation where you need to work out how to add a virtual stream to your business and it doesn't have to to be complicated. Now, I've also got a companion video and post that goes with this where I share links to all of the software that I use, the hardware, the setup that I've got. I've got links to all of that for you. Plus, I've also got links on the other software that you might want to use to actually take this and then the other things that you need to be able to set up your business virtually and do it quick. Okay, so that's another bonus that goes there for you. But first of all, let's have a look around. Well, at the moment, this is a view that you may be familiar with if you have watched any of my podcasts. Just a little bit shakier today because I'm using my iPhone. I'm not using my normal format and I'm just holding this on a stick, um, on a selfie stick. So let me show you what I normally do. So, as you can see, I have a nice bright background and I've got a lounge that I'm sitting on. So let me extend my selfie stick out here a little bit so you can see. Sorry about the wobbles. So this seat here that I'm sitting on, the painting is actually one I brought in for my bedroom. I have another one behind there, but I use this one because um, it's bigger, so it fills up the background. For you, it doesn't have to be a painting that you've done yourself. It can be a plain background. The important part is you don't want it to be distracting, okay? You want people to focus on you. Um, if you've got something interesting in the background, that is great, but it is not essential. Less is more. I've just got a really simple lounge and, let me see if I can show you. Leo, up your hop, and a dog. <laughs> sitting on my lap as well. So I've just got a simple lounge. Now this is a lounge when I decided that I was going to set this little studio up. Um, I just got it on Facebook. Facebook, one of those Facebook marketplaces like 50 bucks. It's a really, really good lounge. So you don't have to spend a fortune. Um, now, and honestly, I just found that one and went and picked it up that day and had all this set up. I'll just show you how much space is actually available. Here to the left, that's that little space. And there is the door, it's a bedroom door. Here on this side, I just go out this way and it's a desk that's got you know all my books and the filing that I shall one day do. Oh, and my award, there you go, um, Australian Marketer of the Year, there you go, one of my books, there you go, just for a little bit of product placement there, folks. Okay, so this is basically the setup. Now this is where most of my videos are done. This is the Lounge of Wisdom. Now. What I'm going to show you here, I'm just going to stand up. So Leo, off your hop. Right, I'm going to stand up here. I'm just going to move this back so you can see the setup. So there in front of my lounge and squished cushion, you can see I have a laptop 
and I have um, a camera that is set there. So I'm gonna go around and show you those. And this here has all been set on a filing cabinet that is on wheels. You don't have to do that. I just do that because I've got a little space and that normally just goes underneath that desk there with all the cords. So I just roll it out when I wanna use it. So let me now take you back here and let me see if I can do a kind of watching Janet. If my camera, if I'm going off the camera, I keep on forgetting and I'm getting distracted by myself trying to see you can see things. Okay, so let me turn it around now so you can see what I have set up here on my desk. Here we go. It is Janet's section. There's two of us. Okay, so what you can see here is first of all, I've just got my laptop here and I have got that. Um, I wanted it a little bit higher, so I've actually just got it. Let me see if I can do this for you better. It's actually sitting on a book, which happens to be a big old family Bible. Let's squish that up. Um, which is quite funny because I'm not even religious, so there you go. The, um, the business means on a Bible. Sorry, this is a little bit squishy. Okay, so I've got my laptop there. Now, the other thing that I've got, you'll see, this is my webcam, and I've got that because, honestly, the, um, the video that comes in with my computer, it, the, the camera's not very good. So this one here is a Logitech HD 1080p, and I've got all the links to that in the post that goes with this. It's really, it's, it's quite, um, you know, it's quite good value for money, it's not expensive, and it just plugs into a USB. So... In there, I've also got um, another thing that I've got plugged in here, which is a Rode um, microphone. Now, that Rode microphone is, um, it's not really necessary. I use that one for, um, I use that one because I'm, uh, when I'm recording podcasts and things, but at the moment, I don't have any, um, any microphone because honestly, I, I couldn't find it. <laughs> I haven't got one plugged into my phone, but um, you could actually run this whole thing. You could do all of your videos just putting your phone on top of this selfie stick here. So on top of this selfie stick that I've got here, you could just put your phone on top there. So um, yep, so that is the camera that I use. That is the um, that is the extra um, microphone that I use when I'm doing podcasting, and that's all you need on that laptop. So I've got all those links there. For you now come back around to me folks hope that was clear I can't really see it um, now let me just show you the room so I'm gonna stand up whoops okay I'm gonna stand up here I'm just standing here in the middle of the room this is a tiny little room and I'll just show you how the whole setup is so you've got the lounge with my setup there in front now the other thing you're gonna need is lighting so if I just go around here, you can see the lighting that I use. These ones here are, um, are just lighting that you would use, say, for photography um, or for videoing. They're, I think it cost me about 130 bucks for three of them, and that is through eBay. So I've got these ones you can actually extend, and they could be standing up. These ones I've actually made them smaller, and I just keep them permanently on my desks. So you can see I've got one... One that shines behind me so that there's no shadows. Another one that shines on me. And then I've got over here, there's the other one that just sort of gives a side lighting to me. Um, now, that's a really great setup to have. And, um, you know, they, they do fold up. They're, I'll tell you what, they're a pain in the butt. Once you put them up, you don't want to take them down again. But, you know, you can. Now, I've also, just so you can see my setup, I also have over here, is my I, I actually use three screens so I have my laptop is normally sitting there near the vase of flowers and I have two other screens I just find that makes me so much more productive and you can see down here I don't use a normal chair I use a Pilates ball so much better for your spine um, so just continuing the 360 you can see that I've got my lights my huge pile of books <laughs> um, and then I've also put over here a stick on whiteboard. I just got that again off eBay and 
make sure you have a few people to help you put it up because it's quite funny. Um, but that's really fantastic because what I do is if I want to be doing brainstorming with a client and I want to be able to map things out for them in their visual, I just simply spin my, um, my filing cabinet around and the camera's facing there. I just sit there on my Pilates ball in front of the camera and I get out my whiteboard markers and draw. So as you can see, this is not even a double bedroom. This is just a small single bedroom and I've got a setup here where I can do uh, creating videos which are um, you know, wisdom from Janet, they're podcasts and it looks really, really professional. I've got good lighting and honestly, I can walk in the house and within a minute, I can be running a video meeting with good lighting, good setting, good camera and I can say within a minute because I do it constantly <laughs> when I run in to run meetings with my clients um, and I've usually just returned from, from the gym that I'm running in. So it can happen really, really efficiently, very, very quickly. Um, and the setup is there permanently. I can also just move this camera and put it in over, um, over onto my computer and I could be running it from my desk if I want to. I do do that sometimes. Um, and then also, you know what? You could just, instead of having the laptop and having the webcam and even having the Rode microphone, which is just a nice luxury to have, you don't need it. Um, I could just instead put my iPhone and just stick it there on that tripod. That selfie tripod is really, really handy. I could run the whole thing that way and I have a long time. Okay, so there goes your last excuse, folks. You do not have an, have an expensive setup. All up, including having the lounge, including having the whiteboard, um, the stick on whiteboard and getting the tripod and the webcam. We might be looking at say 500 bucks, but hey, you can just start with your iPhone and, um, and quietness, and maybe sunlight. There you go. There goes your last excuse, folks. It does not need to be expensive. You do not need to have a proper studio set up. I've just used a spare room. Prior to that, I would just do it in my lounge room or I'd do it outside. So there goes your last excuse. This is a great way for you to be able to set up virtually and you can run an entire successful business with only this setup. Okay, again, I've got, um, I'll put links down below for you. I've got a page on the romanceyourtribe.com website where I've put links to every single thing that I've mentioned here. So you can go and get them yourself. And I've also got their links and a podcast episode that shows you the extra things that you can be doing so that you can take the money, get the bookings made in, that you can do the recordings, that you can run the whole virtual business and this is the extra bonus of the behind the scenes setup. So all of that there is there for you. So there you go. No excuse. Get it set up. Get it happening. Bye.